start a new spot on Lay Lake, right? Hmm. Hey, speaking of August, didn't you fresh off the boat get a fresh delivery today? I know what we're going to do today. What you cooking? <laughs> We're gonna do some uh, crawfish creole, some uh, some red snapper, got taters, garlic mash. We're gonna do a crawfish creole pasta. So we have the andouille sausage. I don't know, I'm just hungry, man. I'm trying to throw some stuff together. Nice. I don't claim to be no professional by no means, but uh, we're gonna show you how the squash bros eat. You know what I'm saying? Got our, uh, got our pasta bowl, got our taters bowling, and uh, I'm just gonna throw some butter in here. Butter. I'm just gonna dump a big old chunk right off in that pasta. And, uh, we've already got most of our seasonings for our fish and our, our creole and all that stuff over here. Um, the fish, I think I'm just gonna hit it up this time with some uh, or some uh, Tony Satries. Creole, why not? Else? I would just say Tony Creole. Tony Creole on the red snap. That already looked good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I it just like that. Sushi. I'm gonna take these little fillets. I'm gonna hit them with a little oil. You hit everything with oil. I don't know why you wouldn't. Alright, we're gonna put a little all over them. We're gonna rub it in. Mm. Make that season stick a little better too. Tony Satchies. Just give them a good little douse. Alright, now we got that fish ready. We get the uh, get the crawfish creel sauce started. Creel seasoning. Uh, we're gonna hit it with a sauce. Two, two or three tablespoons. Oh yeah, that looks great. Get the uh, get the olive oil medium heat. And, uh, saute some uh, chopped up some uh, onions, some uh, bell peppers. A little bit of diced jalapeno on there. You get those sauteed up. These onions and peppers are about done. Just saute them, soften them up a little bit. It's probably about a cup of uh, chopped up onions and peppers, a little bit of jalapenos for flavor. Um, got about a tablespoon and a half, like some minced garlic. Just gonna throw that in. I'm gonna let that go till uh, we get a little bit of aroma. We got it here. We got a tablespoon of paprika, uh, about three tablespoons of creole, uh, a tablespoon of salt, and a tablespoon of parsley. And uh, we throw that in after we let the milk simmer down. Come on, uh, let that garlic go for a minute. And we're gonna come back with some milk in it. Uh, put about a cup of milk in, maybe a half a cup, depending on how much you need. <laughs> I mean, there's no science to it. He ain't much left in there, just salt, babe. Honestly, I like to usually like to cook these shrimp 
before uh, before I throw them in, I like to smoke them a little bit. They'll cook in here just fine, so we're just gonna dump them straight in like that. And then we got these crawfish tails. We're gonna dump these in right on top of them. Let's tear that around. Man, I'm doing this because I'm lazy. I like to throw my fish and get it so I can uh, it'll alert me. It's good. Pull it off about uh, 145. You can wait till it's white and flaky. We got a grill going about 300. Um, you know, it'll fluctuate up a little bit. It's fine. 300, 350. We'll let this go for a little bit. We got our Andouille sauce in here. Gonna pull it out. Fill in that uh, crawfish Creole sauce we got. It's gonna be the Delicious. I'm telling you. Y'all just wait a minute. You <laughs> can jump a pint of heavy cream in there. Oh, real heavy like. Yeah. Nothing light about that cream. Oh, oh my soul. <laughs> uh oh. That wasn't my drink. Can your dishwasher cook? <laughs> Alright, we pulled uh pull some sauce out to go on the fish. Uh I'm gonna dump the rest of it over the noodles. Got a uh, everything simmered down looking good. I don't know, is that a word for cooking simmer? I think that's what we do. Dump it right on in there. Just a little bit. No, I'm just kidding, all of it. <laughs> Noodles are gonna be so noodly. Oh, that's gonna be the best. Cajun pasta. Looking tasty. Alright. Long awaited the masterpiece. Oh! <laughs> That right there, red. Man, I gotta say, this looks amazing. <laughs> After a long slaving day in the kitchen, you know what you get? I don't know yet, but I'm gonna let y'all know. I've had this before, kinda similar. Anything like last time. I'm taking a bite. I'll let you know if you let me know about it. I'm gonna take a bite. I'm, I'm waiting on you. Oh, I'm waiting on you. Oh, 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 oh. Oh! I'll say it again, Campbell. Oh, I will. What's this? Oh, Taylor with this salad. Oh! Oh my God! Pasta's on point. Everything's on point, bro. Right? The taters, the fish, the shrimp, the crawfish tails, the season. That fish wings stay together. It's just flaking apart. No smoker. Oh, Lord. The fill up. Mm. Oh, my. Oh. Mm. Snapper, fresh shrimp, the Louisiana, and uh, crawfish tails. Fresh off the boat. Let me give a shout out to them. They got a location in Ellie City, Alabama. And uh Silicon, Alabama. So like, share, comment, subscribe, turn on that bell too, so you get notified when we post more of this squatty goodness. And if there's anything y'all want to do, smoke, dabble in, eat raw. Put it in the comments below. We'll try. <laughs> See you guys next time.